Okay, everybody open the textbooks. Eleventh question. So the diagram is given in textbook only. That only I am preferring. Hmm. A tower mobile stands vertically on a bank of a canal. Okay, see, this is a tower. This is the this is the tower that is standing. If I see it from here, it is 30 degree. If you see it from here, it is a 60 degree. And the length from here to here, if you, if it travels, it is 20 meters. 20 meters, things like that. The length is 20. Huh, read further. From a point of the other bank directly opposite the tower. The angle of elevation of the top of the tower, tower is 60 degrees. Hmm. From another point 20 meter away from this point on the line. Correct. From another point from 20 meter away means only we took 20 here. We don't know this length. We don't know this length. So I will take it as a x. Okay. I don't know this length. They have given me this length. From here to here it is 20 meters. And the angle of elevation is 30 degree. No, the line joining the, this point to the foot of the lower tower, the angle of elevation of the top of the tower is 30 degrees. Hmm. Find the height of the tower. So I should find height and this is a width. Width is x. Height and width is x. Getting or no? I should find the height of the tower. Okay. So first with which triangle I should start according to you guys? 60. 60 degree. Correct. Because I have everything. This is h. This is x. And I know that angle is also 60 degree. Right, so I will begin with the small triangle that is BCD in triangle BCD in triangle BCD where is the angle? Angle is forming here. If this is the angle, where is perpendicular? Where is perpendicular? Perpendicular is DC. This is perpendicular. Where is base? This is hypotenuse. Correct? Correct? Now write the formula. In father, this is for sine cos tan. Okay, sine cos tan. Now, which I should use? Which one I should use? Either sine cos or tan. Which one should I use? See here. The important thing to find is x and h. Correct? Are they asking me to find this length h hypotenuse? Are they asking me to find hypotenuse? No. They are only asking me to find x that is width and height. So I am only concerned of this and this side. Am, am I concerned of this side? No. So this is perpendicular. This is base. Where is perpendicular and base? Perpendicular and base is there in tan. Correct? So I should use tan. Did it? Understood? So tan, tan 60 is equal to tan 60 degree. Why I took 60 degree? Because 60 degree is there. Tan 60 is equal to P by B. P means what? DC. P means perpendicular means DC. Okay. And P by B. B means BC. Understood or no? Tan 60? Tan 60? Root 3. Root 3 is equal to DC by DC is how much? DC is H. H. DC is H. 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 And DC is a X. X. So H is equal to root 3. X. X. We have done this type of sum before also. H is equal to. Now under two sums are there. As I go further, same. This will be same. Always remember you will get H is equal to root 3. X whenever you have 60 degree here and you will stand. 3, 4 sums are of same pattern. Okay. You will understand further. Okay. Next. Now I got H. Now, now small triangle is over. Now I should go to the big triangle. Okay. In triangle ADC. ADC. In triangle. In triangle ADC. Now same here also I am concerned of only what? This and this. Yes or no? Am I concerned of this? No. This is the angle that it is making. See here. Now see the whole triangle. In between. Now don't see this. Now see the whole triangle. If you see for the whole triangle, if this is the angle, this is the perpendicular again. Same. 
this is the base this full is base correct so tan this time tan 30 degree 30 degree is equal to what is the perpendicular dc by what is the base ac dc by ac now to make ac see here dc is as it is to to make ac can i write like this ab plus bc yes or no ac means what ab plus bc that only i will write now ac is equal to ab plus bc so tan 30 is equal to how much 1 by root 3 1 by root 3 is equal to how much is dc h h dc is h hold it by how much is ab a B is 20 plus X. how much is BC X understood or no okay now still I should change 1 by root 3 once again same 1 by root 3 is equal to H means how much now getting or no so only we are taking H value it will definitely be useful there okay H is equal to root 3 X whole divided by 20 plus X now 20 plus x, I will send it this side, uh, root 3 will come this side. So 20 plus x into 1, 20 plus x. As it is. 20 plus x into 1, 20 plus x is equal to root 3x into root 3. Root 3x into root 3. Understood or no? Understood? Okay. 20 plus x is equal to root 3 into root 3? 3x. Now x, I will send that side x will go that side 20 is equal to 3x minus 2x 20 is equal to 3x minus x 3x minus 2x x x is equal to yes sorry 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 okay i wrote 2x 3x minus x 1x is going there so 3x minus x 2x 2x is equal to 20, x is equal to 20 by 2. See here, once again I will tell you, 20 plus x is equal to 3x, x which was there, 3x minus x, 20 is equal to 3x minus x, 3x minus x, 2x. x is equal to 20 by 2, 2 ones are 2, 10 are x is equal to 10. Correct? Now what is x here? x is the value of from bc so bc is equal to how much 20 10 sorry bc is equal to x is equal to 10 and we, we should find the h height height h is equal to height is equal to how much root 3 x root 3 into x is how much so 10 root 3 is meters is a height x is equal to 10 meter this type of sums we have done before and next similar sums are there okay right any doubts take okay next sum I have recorded, you can write from there, okay? We have missed the class. Next one, next one. Read. Twelfth question. From the top of a 7 meter high building. See here. There is a building which is how much, how much taller? 7 meters. 7 meters tall. Huh. The angle of the elevation of the top of a cable tower is 60 degrees. See here, here is a table tower. Cable tower cable tower building this is building which I, which is 7 meters and there is a cable tower huh. okay see here from here if this is a building if you see from here the angle of elevation is how much it seems 60 degree how much 60 degree next and the angle of Hmm. Determine the height of the tower. Understood the question? So this is a building. This is the tower. This is the tower. 
the angle of elevation from the top of the building to the top of the tower is 60 degree the angle of elevation from the top of the building to the foot of the tower is 45 degree i should tell the height of the building this height is question mark height is equal to question mark okay so what i will name them okay 1 a b c d e so i should find ec ec is my answer getting or no height of the question height of the tower so how should i start so 60 degree see before going to this sum one one angle sum have you do you know this parallel lines okay what are parallel lines the, the lines which does not intersect correct these are parallel lines so there there was a theorem for in ninth alternate interior angles yes. correct so this and this will be alternating yes correct alternate interior angles will be always equal if this is 30 degree this also will be okay similarly one more we have this and this more this and this correct if this 45 this also will be 45 there is no doubt if they if the both line, if these both lines are parallel then ultimately alternate alternate interior angles will happen ill like nodri id 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 matte id matte id angle id matte id angle this and this this and this will be what a equal definitely they will be equal getting or so this theorem i will use and do the sum the where i will use here this this line and this line are they both parallel yes they both are parallel if this is 45 degree this will be how much understood how i did it so this and this i have used what here alternate <coughs> interior angles this is the transversal that is cutting kana dethili so if this is 45 degree this also will be 45 degree now see triangle abc which triangle in triangle in triangle abc can you tell me where is the perpendicular ab ab is perpendicular okay where is the base base bc bc is the base this is hypotenuse this is hypotenuse correct so what i should find now base i should find base, base yes. is this important for me hypotenuse no so to find base i have perpendicular so i will use perpendicular and base correct which i should use tan i should again use tan okay so tan tan as both p and b tan tan 45 is equal to what what is a p by b p is ab ab by bc understood or not what i am doing okay how much is tan 45 1 how much is ab 7 7 how much is bc that only i am finding bc only i am finding bc will come here so bc is equal to also how much 7 so they both are same so i understood that bc is also 7 meters understood or not so by this i also understood this if this is 7 meter how much will be the ad because it is square or no square but they both are equal if this is 7 meter ultimately ad also will be equal to 7 meter now see this triangle now okay, this is e now see this triangle now i already got ad now can i find this or no yes finding this will be easier finding that will be easier okay one second is cotar na ha see if this is ab is equal to 7 meter how much will be dc this is also 7 meter so i have already found this now only this i should find if i find this i will add this and this understood what i did understood what i did okay so in triangle in triangle ade okay this is the angle 60 degree so where is perpendicular ED is perpendicular. Okay, this is base. This is the base. This is a hypotenuse. In triangle ED, I should I should find perpendicular, and I have base which I should use tan. Okay, इधर तेरे आप अंदर साक tan which degree sixty degree is equal to perpendicular by base that is ED by ED by ED. How much is tan sixty? Root three. Root three is equal to how much is ED? That only I am finding ED as it is. Hold it by ED. ED is seven. So ED is equal to seven root three meters. Easy. 
easy now i understood ed also i have dc also so if i add my work is four so i should find what ec i should find ec height of tower tower is equal to ec correct ec is the height of tower but ec has in it ec has ed plus plus dc how much is ed 7 root 3 how much is dc 7 what is common 7 is common okay 7 of root 3 plus 1 this is the answer this is the height of the tower this is the height of tower understood or no once again i will tell you what i did okay very very simple only this was given only this was given and this angle and this angle was given by this i took this by alternative alternate interangles how did i get this you can write here alternate interangles i was alternate interangles i use alternate interangle property in this in this triangle okay so only i got this angle idna bandide illa andra idu nanu sikthide illa correct by this i found out the base as i understood base this also ad is also same because they both are equal and if ab is equal to dc this also came 7 idu work mood bidide illa next i jump to the above triangle it's seven sigma it is easy i can find my data. this was easy to find i found out like that tan 60 tan is my data amel i added both of them easy yes. right any doubts yes. okay next sum read as observed from the top of a 75 meter height 13th one na 13 35 meter. Ah, 13 some other. Both. As observed from the top of a 75 meter height, ah. light passes from the sea level hmm. to the ground. The angles of the depression of the two ships are 30 degree and 45 degree. See, how the sum is framed, I will tell you first. Afterwards, I will explain how, it, how I will make it easy. This is a tower. Okay, and here C is there. On C only tower is there. Okay, and there are two ships. Here first ship is there. Here second ship is there. Okay, think ship. Okay, now from here to here, the angle it is making, the angle that it is making is how much? Yes, angle it is 30 and 45. 40, 30 and 45. 45. Now you guys should tell me where I should take 45, where I should take 30. This is the. Ship for 45, this is first ship, this is first ship, second ship. Two angles he has given 45 and 30. Where here what I should take here here what here what I should take? First ship. First ship what I should take? Why? Why 45? Getting or no? This will be the first first question that will be hitting you. Always remember, the angle is a little bit high. Now if I go here further and see the angle is a little bit high. Correct. So as I go further, the angle will increase. Simple. As I go further, the angle will increase. I can see it easily. If I go front, I should see it like this. Yes or no? So angle is increasing, means this will be definitely 30 degree. This will be over 45 degree. Getting or no? But how he has referred to the question means here. This is the tower. Okay, if I take from here, the angle depreci dep depreciating that means it is going like this now. The angle is going like this. If I take like this, if this is 30 degree, see, think if this is 30 degree, the alternate angle will be 30. getting or not like this. The sum is there, and this is how much uh, 45 degree it seems. If this is 45 degree, alternating will be 45. 45. This is the real diagram, but in the Hogangila, correct? Uh, to make it simple, you can just think like this. 30 degree, 45 degree. Right. If you see from here, it is 30 degree. If you see from here, it is 45 degree. Okay, and I should what I should find? I should find the distance between this ship and this ship. The distance is question mark. Understood? And what is given for me? This is only the given thing. Height of the tower is only the given thing. And the degrees. Okay. So this is X. This is X. Gotila. Gotila. Idu gotila. This also I don't know. So first I should find this. Next, we will find this. Okay. So, I will name them A, B, C, D. Okay. Enough. So, instead of X, I will write, I will take it as BC only. I will take it as 
me see now in triangle first which triangle i should start now let's start with the bcd bcd 45 degree triangle in triangle bcd okay this is the angle it is making so where is our perpendicular 75 this is our always first prefer this one this only first right perpendicular base then you start thinking what to take huh? this is our base this is our hypotenuse now is hypotenuse important for me no no i am only concerned about this width so at one i am correct leave that so base and perpendicular is important perpendicular is gone so i am taking that so base and perpendicular is in which what tan, tan. so i should use tan, tan. tan okay again same tan 45 ella some same adavil tan 45 is equal to how much perpendicular by base perpendicular is what a dc and what is the base base is bc correct now tan 45 one is equal to how much is dc 75 how much is bc bc only i am finding that only bc bc is equal to 75 meters understood or no so bc is equal to how much now 75 always remember whenever you have tan whenever you have tan 45 degree id mathi id same barthe because one barthe idla ig 1 2 3 sums madena you might be getting that if error correct madadre if you get tan 45 idu sikta adu idu idu same barthe okay next okay i have found already this now only this i should find now we'll take the full triangle full triangle hing thoda ko bete but abd see angle is 90 degree here no so we shouldn't go like that getting or no always try to make 90 degree ac d in triangle acd okay now again this is the angle here angle is there so that is a perpendicular this is a base now is this important not important perpendicular by base where it is there tan again same tan i should use so tan 30 degree is equal to what is the perpendicular dc what is the base ac same like last sum dc by ac means what ac can be broken down as ab plus bc ab plus bc now tan 30 means 1 by root 3 is equal to how much is dc 75 75 okay how much is ab that only i am finding correct ab as it is how much is bc now i can find ab or no did it is it the sum all sums are same one sala nimu one one yard sum first if you understand all sums are same okay ab plus 75 will go here ab plus 75 into 1 ab plus 75 is equal to 75 root 3 75 will send that there ab is equal to 75 root 3 minus 75 ab is equal to 75 of root 3 minus 1 meter this is the distance that is the distance between the two ships any doubt yes easy yes right take it sir that ab equal to 90 degree irbeku every time 90 degree irbeku every time we can't take this amage thone endu tilko ig ning bidi godithe na ಬಿಡಿ ಗೊತ್ತೈತಿ ಗೊತ್ತಿಲ್ಲ ಎ ಬಿ ಗೊತ್ತೈತಿ ಅದು ಗೊತ್ತಿಲ್ಲ ಮತ್ತೆ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀನಿ ಏನು ಗೊತ್ತ ಇಲ್ಲ ಹೆಂಗ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀವಿ ತಿಳಿಯತಿಲ್ಲ ರೈಟ್ Sit go ahead, see here, no? Next sum. Read. 14th sum. A 1.2 meter tall. A 1.2 meter tall bird stops the balloon moving with the speed. Sit go ahead. Sit go ahead, see here. Next sum. Good pa. A 1.2 meter tall bird stops. See here, there is a girl eh, who is height, how much is, how much is height? 1.2 meter tall. ಹೋಯ್ ಗಪ್ ಕುಂದಿರ್ತೀರಿ ಎಂಪ ಹೋಯ್ ಇನ್ನೋಟ್ಸ್ 
there is a girl who is 1.2 meter tall next sports are believed to move with the wind in a horizontal line at height of 82 88.2 meters बट गर्ल सैट इज मच 1.2, so 88.2 minus 1, uh, 1.2, 87, 87 meter. इलिन दिली तंग का किंग कंड इंद्रा, ये बलून तंग का ऐसे दी, 87. Getting or no? If you use 88.2, your sum is gone, gone how the? Clear the? From the ground it is 88.2, but her height is 1.2. Getting or no? So 88.2 minus 1.2, it is 87 meter from her eyes. If she sees from her eyes, eyes side, clear the? Okay, now where she is seeing? She she is seeing from here to here. Okay, first balloon, second balloon is here. This is second balloon. Oh. The angle of the elevation of the balloon from the eyes of the girl at any instant is 60 degree. Ah. After some time, the angle of the elevation reduces to 30 degree. Ah, now where I should take 60 degree and where I should take 30 degree? So, first, 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 first is 60 degree. Yes, man, or other not? Correct. So this is sixty degree. Next, this one long is this is a thirty degree. Getting or understood how to take sixty degree, thirty degree? Where angle of elevation is more, there you take more angle. Okay, first you, you, if you draw, you will understand where to take. This is this much is given now. For, further. Find the distance traveled by the balloon during the entire tour. So I should find the distance from here to here. How much it has traveled? Getting or from first balloon to second balloon. I should find the distance from here to here. That means what? I should find this. I should find this. If I find this, I will understand. Okay. So I will name them A, B, C, D, E. Okay. Some people will even name this also. You do name mark that. Not it. Now name mark that. Okay. Because it's not important. First, इला name mark बोलते हैं. E, ये देखो मेरे F, G. So first, okay. A, D, B. First, E C how I took that will write E C is equal to see E C minus what I did E C minus sorry E C minus E C E C minus C C I did correct E C was eighty eight point two minus one point two that is equal to eighty seven meters correct this is how I got E C E C eighty seven meters. Why did I minus? Because that is the girl's height. Okay. Next. Now which triangle I should take first? So A D A C E. First we'll take the this A, triangle. A B D will take. A, C, See here. If this is eighty seven, na this will be how much? This will also be eighty seven. Okay. Because both are flying at same height. This is also eighty seven. It cutter. Yes. So I can use that. Getting or no? Okay. So. Hmm. In triangle, in triangle, A B D, A B D, okay. This is the angle. This is the angle. Then this will be perpendicular. This is base. This is hypotenuse. What I should use? Tan sixty degrees. Tan. Tan sixty is equal to P by B. P is how much? D B. DB by AB. How much is tan sixty? One by root, sorry, only root three. Confusion. Root three is equal to DB eighty seven. AB that only I am finding. AB only I am finding the AB as it is. AB will go here. AB is equal to eighty seven by root three. Okay, that. Tan sixty root three. It is root three. Three number did it. Eight seven by. Understood or no? So how much is the AB? Eighty 
Next, what I should find the BC. Now, instead of finding BC, what I will do, I will try to find the AC. I will try to find AC because AC minus AB, I will get BC. Correct? I will go like that. In triangle, in whole triangle, no. In triangle, the whole triangle is AC, ACE. This is the angle 30 degree. This is the perpendicular. That is the base. So again, tan tan 30. Tan 30 is equal to base by P by B, EC by EC by AC. Now EC by AC, we can do it two ways. Agar split mein dalangu maar bolna. But this time I will go directly. Tan 30 means one by root three is equal to EC is how much? 87 by AC. AC. AC is how much? 87 by root three plus BC. Hang maar diye direct will get BC only. Like that also we can do. Other maar bolli. I will split that angle. Ille maar thi. Split maar bolli. AC by first. AB plus BC. One second. Thirty. Our one problem aap bolte. Root sada gaye thoda. Root thagad bolli first angle under. See here root is there. If I should do like that, I should remove the root. To remove root, what I should do? Rationalize. Correct. If rationalize maar bolga thoda. Ille one second thirty. The answer is 87. And the direct method is 9 which are not the same. What I was thinking is, I will get AC, somehow I will get AC. If I know 87, this I will get. If I know this, I can, this minus this, I will get this or no? Nang which are not the same. One second. AC if I take a, AC by, AC is not the same. AC as it is not the same. Okay, both ways we can go. First, none way might be the same. So both ways I will do and so see here. Even his way also will do and so my way also. It first thing rationalize my brother. So it will be easy for us. 87 by root 3 will be tough. So I'll rationalize 87 by root 3 into root 3 by root 3. So that will be 87 root 3 upon 3. See if, if I can cancel. 3 ones are 8 plus 7, 8 to 10, 15. Cancel our case. Okay. So 3 ones are 3 twos are 6. 27 <coughs> nines are 29 root 3. Correct? That is easy now. So, AB is how much? 29 root 3. Twenty nine root 3. First even method will be. Agali other method. First that method only will do. Say no. As he is saying, AC means what? AC can be broken down as AB plus BC. Now, how much is AB? Just now I got 29 root 3 plus. How much is BC? BC only I am finding. BC only I am finding. Correct? Now, this full will go this side. 29 root 3 plus BC is equal to 87 root 3. 87 into root 3, 87 root 3. 29 root 3 will send there. BC is equal to 87 root 3 minus 29 root 3. BC is equal to 87 minus 29. It's like XX. Both are same. Now we can minus 87 minus 29. 87, 80, 80, 78, 58, 58, 58 root 3 is the answer. So the distance between the, the two, two balloons is how much? 58 root 3 meters. Or what you can do? 9 maadathi dhendra. My idea was, first AC find maadathi ni. Heading or no? Will maadathi usli? My idea was like this. Tan 30 is equal to, directly will do. Tan 30 is equal to how much? Or 1 by root 3 is equal to AC by, AC is how much? 87 by AC. Full AC I will take. AC no urkaathen lana. Pura AC. Adri long akhe. This is long. Okay. AC will come here. AC is equal to how much? 87 root 3. Bantha. AC bantha. 
और नेक्स्ट नौ आई एम फाइंडिंग बी सी सो बी सी इज इक्वल टू वॉट ए सी माइनस ए सी माइनस ए बी पा ए सी माइनस ए बी ये सोर नो बी सी मीन्स वॉट इफ इन दिस इफ आई रिमूव दिस गेट दिस नो क्या तो लेने लाते हैं तो फाइंड दिस दिस माइनस दिस इफ आई डू गेट दैट हाउ मच इज ए सी ए सी जस्ट बने थी एट सेवन रूट थ्री माइनस ए बी ए बी ट्वेंटी नाइन रूट थ्री ए बी फाइन मे इले इले ए बी इज योर ओके ट्वेंटी नाइन रूट थ्री सो आंसर इज फिफ्टी एट रूट थ्री बोथ यूल गेट सेम आंसर्स बट मेथड इज डिफरेंट इन स्कूल विच दे टेक आई डोट नो बोथ आर सेम ट्रीथ अंडर्स्टूड वॉट एड इट यूर सेल मैल तेल मैल तेल आते हैं अद एडेड मेथड अब यार बेहद निम्न चूज मेरे जैकेट मतलब विच यू अंडर्स्टूड यू डू यू कैन रईट यू गेट द सेम आंसर्स नेक्स्ट सम नेक्स्ट सम इज वेरी इजी एंड इंपॉर्टेंट ओके मेनी टाइम्स इट हैज अपीयर्ड रीड अ स्ट्रेट हाईवे ओवर रीच टू द फुट ऑफ अ टावर व मैन स्टैंडिंग एट द टॉप ऑफ द टावर ऑब्जर्व्स अ कार एट द एंगल ऑफ अ डिप्रेशन ऑफ 30 डिग्री हम्म सर एवरी चीज अप्रोचिंग द फुट ऑफ द टावर With a uniform speed of six seconds later, the angle of the depression of the car is found to be sixty degrees. Find the time taken by the car to reach the foot of the tower. Okay, see. There is a man standing on the tower. Okay, and he is seeing a car which was here. Okay, so till here it is making how much angle? Thirty degree. That means how they are explaining here? They are explaining in this sense. So this this is thirty degree. Alternating angle will become a thirty degree. This is how I have took. Similarly, this will become how much? Sixty degree. So from here he sees the car going from here to here. This is how much? Sixty degree. Sixty degree angle. Now he is saying angle full sixty degree. No other than so this also becomes sixty degree. Correct. Now what they are asking is from here to here if it moves it takes six seconds uniformly. Okay. From here to here to move from here to the tower. This is a tower. How many seconds will it take? That is the question. Getting or understood the question? From here to here it takes six. From here to here, how much it will take? Okay. So the height of the tower is not given, so it is as h. And this also I don't know. I will take this as x. And this is sixty degree. I only know this one. Okay. I will name the points. And these are cars. My three and five are battery. B, C, D. Okay. So which triangle I should begin now? B C D B C D Y C R. One number sixty degrees there. H is equal to root three. X same that only I will get now. Okay. So in triangle, in triangle A B C D, in triangle B C D. This is the angle. If this is the angle. This is the perpendicular point. This is the base. This is the hypotenuse. Correct? Correct? So what I should use a perpendicular and base I should use because this is not useful. This I should leave. So tan tan what sixty degree is equal to what is the perpendicular base? Let's see tan sixty tan sixty root three root three is equal to how much is DC H DC is H BC X H is equal to Root three x. X will go here. Okay. 
So h is equal to root three. X. Understood or no? Always you'll get this only. Don't get confused. Root three by x power varying la. H is equal to root three x only will get maximum times. Huh? Now I will move to the big triangle. In triangle A C D full triangle. No? In triangle A C D. Okay. Now again, this is the angle. This is the perpendicular. This is the base. Getting or no? So, tan which angle? Tan 30 degrees is equal to perpendicular by base. Perpendicular is DC by base AC. Now, AC can be written as what? AB plus BC. Same sum, See, this is the third or fourth sum I am repeating today. This is of same time. Okay, so tan 30, 1 by root 3. How much is DC? H. This is H. How much is AB? 6. How much is BC? X. This is X. How much is H? H is equal to root 3? X. So 1 by root 3 is equal to H means root 3. X whole divided by 6 plus x. 6 plus x, I will send it here. This will come here. 6 plus x into 1. 6 plus x as it is is equal to root 3x into root 3. 6 plus x is equal to root 3x into root 3x. 3x, x will go there. 6 is equal to 3x minus x. Okay. So, 6 is equal to 3x minus x. 2x. 3x minus x, 2x, x is equal to 6 by 2, 2 1s are, 2 3s are, x is equal to 3. Correct? x is equal to 3, aram hai be, x is equal to 3, next, next what I should find now, height, height of the tower. So, h is equal to already I know, that is root 3, x, h is equal to root 3, root 3 into x is how much, 3, height of the tower, 3, so you can write here, see here, what you can write is, the time taken to reach the car from here to the tower is how many, how many seconds, 3 seconds, 3 seconds and the height of the tower is, 3 root 3. Height of the tower is not going to be able to get No, the tower is not going to be See your height of tower, you, if you don't write it's okay. Find the time taken. Find the time taken, they are asking. No need to find this, okay. No need to write this. No need to write this. They are not asked. You can just write the time taken to reach to the tower, the time taken by the car to reach the tower is 3 seconds. Oh, it's so much.